Hello everyone, this is Frank from Quiz and Survey Master. Welcome to the Getting Started video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly install and set up Quiz and Survey Master. So let's get started. First, we need to install Quiz and Survey Master. Once the plugin is installed, go ahead and activate the plugin. Once the plugin is installed, you'll see a new quizzes and surveys menu here. So let's create our first quiz or survey. Now on this page, you'll see the name of your quiz, you'll see some short codes for displaying your quiz or survey, and the leaderboard, you'll see how many times it's been viewed and taken, and the last time you modified it. You can edit the name, or we can go ahead and edit the quiz. So here's our questions tab. We're going to go ahead and add a question you can select from a few different question types. We're going to keep multiple choice and we're going to make a quick true and false question. Your quizzes and surveys can be graded in three different grading types. You can either have them not graded, or you can have them points based. So you'll assign points to every answer, or you can mark them as correct incorrect using this checkbox here. So in this case, we're going to say we're going to use the correct incorrect system and say true is the correct answer, and add a false option. Now that we have our question created, we can come over to our emails tab. And we can make sure our emails are turned on and that we are sending our email out to the admin. And if we want, we can add a few other user variables here, such as the username, the user's name, or maybe their email. If we're using the email to be sent to the user as well, you can come up here and customize this email. And then once we're finished, we can hit save and email. And then we can hop over to our results page. This is the page that will get shown once the quiz or survey is submitted. So in this case, we just want to say thank you for submitting your answers. To keep it very simple and quick, and then we can save our results page. And now we can come over here to our preview tab to preview and we will see our current version of our quiz. So we can come over here, we can mark this as true, hit submit. And then there is our thank you for submitting your answers. Now to use this quiz somewhere on your website, there's a few different ways you can add your quiz or survey. You can use this short code here. You can add it to any post or page or any place that takes short codes. You can go to your quiz by clicking this view quiz slash survey and using that URL to create a link anywhere in any of your posts or pages or anywhere else on your website or in your email. 
or you can go to appearance and menus and there is a new section there titled quizzes where you can add your quizzes and surveys to your menus or your navigation. Now, since this is a quick start video, we are not going into a lot of the options that this plugin offers. You can customize most of the text throughout the plugin using the text tab. You can configure a lot of the options using the options tab, options such as using uh, having your quiz and surveys across multiple pages. You can have a timer. You can require quizzes and surveys to require users to be logged in. You can set them to only be available during certain time frames and more using the options tab. We have leaderboards and our certificates. Now back on the emails, you can also have multiple emails where you have a different email sent out depending on how the user scores during your quiz. The results page, you can also have different results page based on how well they score using the incorrect or correct or how many points they earn. Now, once you have a few users taking your quiz or survey, you can come over to the results page to view your results. And then in this case, we have where I submitted a few seconds ago, and then we click view. And we can now view my answers that I gave. As always, if you have any questions or would like to know more about the plugin, we do have a documentation at quizandsurveymaster.com as well as a online academy with a lot of other video tutorials. Lastly, you can come to the help page where there is a help form 